What's going on everyone, Dark Sonic here, and I'm bringing you another episode of Let's Play God of War. In the last episode, we finally beat the Valkyrie. Oh my god, that was just one Valkyrie. And to make it worse, Niflheim has another one. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. More hair pulling, rage inducing fun time. So let's go ahead and let's go off to Niflheim now. Let's see what happens here. Never seen either Niflheim or Muspelheim, so in-game grind has already begun, so let's go ahead and do that. And after that, we still gotta go and find the other Valkyries. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty! want to come here, but here we are. It smells bad. What is this stuff? This mist is cursed. Cursed? Quite right. Safe to breathe for a time, but it'll kill if we linger. Just one more reason to love Niflheim. Boy. Uh -huh. That's one thing we're gonna have to watch out for. Let's now. see. Mist echoes are gonna be important, I think. Let's see what the lore says here. Turn back. Upon this place sits the curse of Ivaldi, whose talents threaten the gods of Asgard. The mists of Niflheim were made a weapon by my father's alchemy and turned upon their creator. His skill as an inventor and craftsman were unrivaled, but it was... His talent and genius, which drew the ire of the Aesir, in the first place. Therefore, I, Motziger, renounce this place. I renounce dwarven kind. I am off to seek refuge in self-imposed exile in Mid Midgard. Those who do not flee this realm will join my father in the grave. Oh, wait. Motziger ended up keeping this kind here to die. What is that wow. stuff? Where? Yes. A strange material. Material that also helps us. Explore, explore, uh, exploration is definitely going to be key here. Ah, uh, that's just wrong. You would put. Inscribed crest of tenacity. Ah! Fancy- I'm surprised you're here, Sindri. This mist is pretty gross. You think I can't handle a little cursed mist? Well, you're right. I'm trying to build some armor that will lessen its effects. The materials I need are all right here in Ivaldi's workshop, but... They're blanketed by this nauseating mist, of course. Wait for it. The last known location for such <laughs> armor is in the workshop's center chamber. The entrance is sealed, but I could craft you an entry stone with enough mist echoes. There it is. <laughs> okay, so we gotta retrieve 500 mist echoes. I wouldn't recommend staying in the mist for too long. That stench will stick to your hair, your weapons, your armor. And I will not touch your gear until you burn all the tiny beasties off in the fires of Muspelheim. Also, it will kill you. Sometimes the best purchase is the one we don't... <laughs> All right, so 500 mist echoes. How, how much do we have now? Eighty-three. Not bad. Not a bad start. 
There's something written here. Evaldi's workshop. These cursed ruins hold rare mist echoes used for crafting magnificent armor. The enemies, traps, and treasures will reset upon your return. Which is good, because we can use this as our farming area, it seems. Escape with what you can, lest the workshop claim you as another this victim. This whole place shuffles around each time we leave? That's incredible! Atreus, focus. This is a dangerous place. That's dwarven creativity for you. Impressive and dangerous. Okay, that's just... Okay. Well, we got this whole entire cursed place to go after. Let's dive in. It's a maze, of course, and I hate mazes. Who was that? what happened. at least 500 so let's hurry up back
Ooh, looks like you found enough echoes. And you're not dead. Very impressive. I was close to it. Sindri, how do you make anything out of mist? Odd as it sounds, the dwarves who lived here could craft marvels out of the mists of Niflheim. Keep an eye out for more mist echoes. I could put them to all sorts of use. Okay. Travel safe, you two. Let's try this again. How much, how far do we have to get? Ah, oh, shit, there goes a Valkyrie. Okay, so we just gotta get back to the center chamber. Mist is thinner up here. That's nice. Is that the armor? It looks kind of run down. Can you wear it? No. It is too small and too old. We will bring it back to the dwarf. I'm gonna grab all these mist echoes while I'm here before we do that. And of course we got these realm tears. <laughs> You gotta have an X amount of mist echoes to open these? Wow. That's actually funny. And I... Wow. Really? Huh. Okay. Mist echoes and something called an anchor of fog. <laughs> yeah, this place just gets crazier and crazier by the minute. And then we have to fight a freaking Valkyrie in this mess. Oh, great. <laughs> Need more time. 
go ahead and get out of here and get back to Sindri. Oh, there's a curse. Oh shit, I know. Is that what I think it is? Useless armor? Useless? Oh, ye of little faith, this armor was worn by Ivaldi himself. Sure, it's seen better days, but I can restore it with more mist echoes. And it'll help with the effects of Ivaldi's curse. Unless there is something of value in this workshop, there is little point in staying here. You saw all the chests in the center chamber, yes? Plus all the goodies tucked away towards the back of the workshop? And the three round tears, of course! But, might want to be careful with those. Why's that? It's a literal tear in the fabric of reality itself. You want to reach your hand through there? Be my guest. Okay. Let's get to it. So I don't have enough mister. Nothing to your liking, I see. Okay, let me see here. Uh... Wasn't that a talisman I had? Or what was that? Perfect artifact of the blight. That's what we'll have to use then until we can get some more. Okay. Let's try and grab some more mist echoes while we can. So the chest switch places, okay.
Interesting. Well, I think we'll probably go ahead and cut this episode here. Uh, this is going to be a little bit more difficult than the other areas. I can't just brute force my way through it, of course. Um, <laughs> hopefully everyone enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. Also, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And hit the notification bell icon to stay updated to whatever I do. And before we do this, I actually want to see this. Hold on. How do you change? <laughs> oh, wow. How many faces does he have? 16 faces. <laughs> All right. Well, this is my reaction to this area. Because it's going to be a long one. So hopefully everyone enjoyed this. And I will see you guys in the next episode.